now that we've done the left join we can do the right join very quickly because the left join and the right join are just interchangeable so in order to do a right join all we have to do and to see the result of that is and the definition really doesn't change so a right join let's just get it right so a right join returns all the records from the right table right and the matching records from the left table and then the result is zero from the left side if there is no match right so in order to just flip that without having to go into the whole exercise again of the right join because it's basically saying the same thing instead of saying left we're saying right is to just come here change this from left to right and then we will see the result of that by hitting F5 and we see that now that we've done a right join it still works out in the definition because we did a right join which basically says that right joining the customer table on sales ID equal and customer ID so now you see that the additional roles that we added went away because it's only giving us those matching values from the right side which in this case is the customer table and the customer table only stopped at the number 10 which is 10 ids so now you know how to do the right join and the left join